Hi, this is Ryan George from Ryan George Fitness. So today we're going to talk about the benefits of calf raises. Calf raises can be really good for developing strength, uh, developing range of motion, developing power. They're really good for athletes, especially athletes in sports that require a lot of jumping, um, landing from jumping, running. So calf raises can really provide a lot of a lot of great strong benefits uh, for athletes and for the layperson, for anybody looking to work out to develop nice strong calves. Um, but with the benefits come a few things to be aware of, really two major things to be aware of. Uh, the first thing is that the calves com are comprised of two different muscles. So the first muscle is the gastrocnemius and the second is the soleus and they both work differently. So the gastrocnemius works on both the knee and the ankle. So any calf raise that you're doing has to be done with the leg straight to work that muscle. If you're going to work the soleus, that only works on the ankle. So if you want to work that muscle, you need to do exercises with the knees bent. So when you're doing calf raises, you kind of have to do both if you want to get the full workout for the calves. The second thing is it's really important to stretch. Most people tend to have overdeveloped or overused calves and then the opposing side, the tibialis anterior, tends to be underdeveloped and weak. So if you're going to work the calves, if you're going to do calf raises, it's really important when you're done to stretch. And just as I mentioned, there are two muscles that you want to work out, there are two muscles that you want to stretch. So if you want to stretch the gastrocnemius, you're going to do the calf stretch with your leg straight. And then in order to stretch the soleus, you're going to do the calf stretch with the leg bent. So this is really simple. You just find a wall or find a spot where you can have one leg straight and one leg bent. So the straight leg is going to be the rear leg, the lead leg or the front leg will be the one that's bent. The rear leg is the one that you're stretching. So all you have to do is bend the knee, lean forward a little bit, and keep the back leg as straight as you can, and also keep your heel on the floor. So the straight leg stretch is going to work the gastrocnemius, and then if you want to get the soleus, all you have to do is bend the knee a little bit, and you should start to feel that stretch lower a little bit, and then you'll get the soleus stretch. So that's it. I hope this helps. If you have any more questions, check me out at Ryan George Fitness.